Hi friends, I have a super fun Walmart haul for you guys. I feel like it's been forever since I've done a haul and mostly that's because I haven't been buying anything because I just have been, not that I'm like uninspired in the planner space, but um, cause I'm definitely still planning. It's just, I haven't been, yeah, I guess I haven't been inspired to like try new things or I haven't really seen anything that I've loved. But um, last month I went to the Erin Condren flagship store in Austin and that just like reignited things for me all the beautiful colors um, and plus like in the fashion industry right now neon is really hot and I've been loving like all of the um, neon colors and I've just been kind of seeing it everywhere so I'm just like feeling it again I'm feeling inspired um, if you've been with me a long time you know I've just kind of gone up and down in this planner world um, but right now I'm on a kick. I'm loving it. I'm loving my Erin Condren planner and I got so much fun stuff to play around with. Um, Walmart, I like Walmart. This is not like sponsored by any means, but I just um, had a lot of fun like going through the stationary aisles. I know it's usually Target that we all love to go to for um, planner and stationary supplies, but I had so much fun at Walmart. They are really stepping up their game and they have a lot of really great um, planner supplies, back to school. Oh, this is always my favorite time of year. If you're going back to school, I'm actually jealous. I mean, I'm never going to go back to school. Well, I should never say never, but I have been in school for a very long time, which by the way, if you are new around here, um, welcome. My name is May. I make videos about things that I love. One of the things that I love is planners and stationery. And I'm always really adamant that I don't think you have to spend a lot of money to be organized and to plan. So I'm just sharing this stuff with you guys because first of all, I thought it was affordable and super cute. But if you're just stumbling upon this video or if you're just starting to explore the planner and organizational world, please don't think that you have to have all of these things to be effective, efficient, organized, productive. Um, none of this is required for that. This is just fun extras and I'm just sharing it because I thought um, they were great finds that are very affordable. So I have been rambling. This is a very long intro. Let's do this. Okay. Um, I spent a total of $66 at Walmart. So everything that I'm going to show you guys, and there is a lot of it, the total was $66. I don't know exact prices on everything. Um, if that will be helpful for you guys, just leave a comment down below and I can look it up. I still have my receipt. I can look it up and tell you the price, but I just already have so much stuff that I don't want to um, spend too much talking about prices, but just know everything here in total was $66. Okay, let's get started. I don't have this very organized, so I'm just going to be pulling things. All right, the first thing is this little pocket planner. You can see it compared to my hand. I try to pick one of these up every year or every two years. I by no means use this for like my main source of planning, but I love to have these um, just for like memory keeping. I like to be able to look back at the year quickly. Um, I will just jot like, you know, trips that I took, maybe a highlight of each day if I'm not like going anywhere. Just very simple, easy memory keeping. Um, maybe I'll throw a sticker in there, but I just like to look at this for that. Sometimes I will use this as an exercise tracker. Um, I just, I like having these, I don't know. So I will use them for a variety of different things, but I just really like these. And I do remember, I think this was $2. All right, next are these pouches. And first of all, how cute are they? I love clear pouches. And to be honest, I bought these just because of the pouches. I really wasn't even paying attention to what was inside of them, but I love this baby pink color. It has some washi in there. This one is punched. Oh, it looks like this one's punched too. So. This would probably fit a personal size planner and then this one would fit an A5. I'm into these colors. I don't know what it is. I'm usually a very neutral girl, but lately I've just been loving colors. This one comes with a pen pouch. It's got these little markers. Um, they're just great and again, very affordable. Oh, here it shows you everything that's in it. Pencil pouch, dashboard, two dashboard inserts, the pen holder and the bookmark clips. And then this one has stickers, the pouch, washi tape, an elastic pen loop, and again, the bookmarks. All right, I couldn't wait. I was gonna show you guys this last, but this is just my favorite thing and it's just over there shiny and staring me in the face and I have to show you guys. How adorable is this? 
Walmart has traveler's notebooks. It's gold. You guys, I don't exactly remember the price, but I think it was maybe like $6. I don't know, maybe $9. Wait, I have to find this and tell you guys, hold on. Okay, I actually don't know because Walmart doesn't have very good descriptions on their receipt and like everything that I bought is a notebook. So, but nothing was more than $7. So this has gotta be $7 or less. I mean, look at this thing, so beautiful. Okay, it comes with two notebooks in it already. It's got the pockets, it has a secretarial pocket. Oh my gosh, like how cute is this? It has a little pen loop back here. And then I also bought two inserts, black and white stripe and the polka dots. I always love having a notebook with me because even if I have a paper planner, which I always use one, there's still just, I like to still have paper to like project plan, make lists. Planners don't always have enough room to write everything out. So I usually have a notebook that's part of my planning system also. And I just love the idea of this one. Oh, I love this. They did have other patterns, but um, I went with the gold. Okay, I tried to group this stuff together. I picked up four notebooks. This one I just got because I love this combo of the zebra and the green and the teal and the gold. And I also really love the size. Um, you can see it compared to these other, I would assume this is like a five by seven. So this is just a smaller size. I always, again, love to keep a notebook with me. So even if I'm not taking my whole planning system, um, I can just have something with me to jot down. So love this, so cute. Okay, this Exceed brand I had shared with you guys in the past. These are, I think, very comparable to the Lectrum, Lectrum, whatever those are on Amazon that everyone uses for bullet journals. This one, um, you can choose, it. you can get dotted, lined. Um, I believe they have the squares as well. I got dotted. So first of all, the quality on these is amazing. I think it is comparable to those other notebooks um, that you can get that are $20 a piece, and these are six. I know $6 may be expensive for a notebook but again when it's compared to the $20 ones um, it's a, it's a bargain and I love this color this is the first time I'd seen this color just like a really fun I don't know what this is purpley lavender lilac maybe it's beautiful this one I picked up because of the color just love me a neon hot pink notebook um, I've never tried this brand before. This one has the lines um, and the paper is kind of creamy color. It's not straight up white. Um, I've never tried this brand, but it's a good hardcover. Seems like it would be good quality and again would be great for a bullet journal. And then the last notebook is just this five subject um, plain black. I really wanted a white five star notebook, but I couldn't find them anywhere. And I loved that this one has tabs um, that are clear. I hope you guys can see that. I'm not sure if that's showing up, but they're clear tabs. Um, so I like to kind of divide up my notes um, and this is perfect for that. Okay, oops, I found one more notebook. Um, this is a big like eight by 10, oh actually nine by 11 notebook. And again, I just picked this up because I love the color of the cover. I'm always using notebooks. So this is nice for like big projects, like things that are gonna really take a lot of time. Um, I like to have a bigger notebook. I don't usually take these on the go with me, but um, you know, they can just stay on my desk and I can plan out bigger projects in here. And again, this color, nice paper, and it, I think it was literally a dollar. I grabbed these huge post-it notes. Um, again, I love the color, the neon pink. There's also neon orange in there. I like these really big sticky notes for making lists in my planner. If I have a day that um, I have like a particularly big to-do list or a lot of activities and I wanna kind of plan it out, hour by hour, I love having these. I grabbed a few of these sticker packs. So these are smaller sticker packs. I think these were a dollar. Walmart has kind of like a dollar spot now, like Target had, um, and these are just really pretty. I mean, look at these gold dots. There's marble, there's this really pretty pattern, and then these are just like kind of fun pink and palm leaves. I love it. And then look at this huge sticker book. I mean, there's so much in here so much I love it and just a lot of different like icons pretty gold foil I really love this and again they had different patterns of this as well I also grabbed these stencils there are eight sheets in here and there's just all these different patterns 
I don't know if you guys can see this, but lots of different icons, banners, squares, and it also has a folder that they all come in. I mean, I'm telling you, Walmart is really stepping it up. Okay, final few things, because I know this is dragging on. These are my absolute favorite pens. I love the nib on them. I love that they're white, they're gel, they write in black ink. I love these. They're a little bit expensive, maybe like four bucks, but worth it. These are my favorite pens. And then these just, I don't know, I just kind of like them. I liked that they were like colorful. You know, those of us that are planner obsessed are usually going for these like fancy pens, but I don't know, something about these. I'm just kind of digging them. They just seem like nice and simple, but still had some fun color. So I don't know. I'm just going to try these. Okay, you guys, we have made it to the end. The last thing are these washi stickers. So it's washi tape, but they're individual stickers. Can you guys see that? And they're these beautiful flowers. Again, they did have different patterns of these as well, but I was really into these florals. So um, I'm excited to like crack this open. Look at this rose, right? They're so beautiful. So that's it, you guys. This is everything that I got from Walmart. Again, $66 for all of it. Check out your local Walmart because they are really doing um, a good job in the stationery and planning department. I saw Happy Planner there. there. I mean, this is by no means exhaustive of everything that was there. There was a ton of stuff and I had to practice a lot of restraint, especially because I haven't been planner supply shopping um, in a long time. But this time of year just gets me and I just had so much fun and I really wanted to buy everything, but I really restrained myself and I got like the things that I only really loved and I'm excited to use. So if you guys got anything from Walmart, leave me a comment down below and let me know what you got. Cause I, um, if there's anything I missed that you saw that I need to go back and get, tell me, because I definitely want to check that out. If you're headed back to school, good luck. If you're new around here, please hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you join my community here on YouTube, over on Instagram, on my blog. We just have a lot of fun. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you guys soon.